Hello, I'm Landis, and welcome back to the Long Dark Winter Mute. Okay, let's get this Great Bear information. What can you tell me about Great Bear? Nothing you can't read in history books. Ugh. Oh, for goodness sake, take this one. <clears throat> Bastard. Oh look, there it is. Yeah, it's not that long. Thank fuck. But places like Great Bear, already quite remote and suffering after decades of economic decline, the sudden collapse was the final straw. Without any major local economic drivers of their own, the remaining communities on Great Bear became completely dependent on a supply lifeline from the mainland. Regular shipments of basic staples designed to keep them alive, fuel, food, medical supplies, etc. In many ways, akin to World War II era wartime rationing. In exchange for regular supply drops, the mainlanders, in some cases, at the behest of their economic overlords south of the border, felt justified in taking whatever supplies and raw materials they needed to maintain the urban communities, including dismantling some of the heavy industrial infrastructure left on Great Bear. Okay, so that's what she's bitching about. Let's top up the old supplies, empty the old bag. Uh, not her. Yes, I think we are almost good to go. Uh, let's get rid of you. Right, so we're going to nip up, grab the cash, go to the graveyard, realise the person she sent us to meet is actually dead. Um, and then see what happens. Yeah, well, providing the wolves aren't there. That oh, looks clear. And that mark's gone from the map, so that did have something to do with the Grey Mother. Maybe a bug, I'm not sure. Either way, we found bugger all there. Unless it's one of the possible locations for the key. But then, why have the uh, jump scare on the dead body? That doesn't make sense. Okay, there are normally rabbits around here. Let's set you up. Any off chance we can catch something? I'm not going to be around long enough to get it. Could skip a couple of days. Should probably look around the other cars and houses to see if we can't find any more notes. Right, so uh, where are we heading? Somewhere around here, there's a hill. Across from the graveyard. It's a 45 degree angle from the back end, okay. Shouldn't be too hard. Let's hope there's no wolfies about. Can, oh, you dirty little shit. Did I reload that? No. That could have resulted in some funniness. There's a hill. There's a corner of the church. Now we find a cache. He said by a tree, didn't he? They're still going. And the wolf's kicking off. Ah, this one. Uh, grumpy joke at all could have the back door open. And a stash of stuff near the big fallen tree in the marshy area. So we want a big fallen tree. 
There. Oh, there it is. Bloody hell. That was easy. Aha. Here it is. Fuel. Stim. So we get cloth. Almost all of the uh, trust we're going to need. Nice. I was on one of these uh, locks. Might have came back for it already. Have I gone too far? Let's just start all the way down there. Yes, directly. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we got stuck on the fence the last time, didn't we? Ah. Lilith Barker. The plot thickens. Also, it says Emily Camp. Dearly loved. Wow. 18. It's young. Rios. Liam Coates. That's Lilith Barker. Damn, 16. Jessica Roy, 25, so she survived longer than most of them. But still, the oldest person in the graveyard is 25 years old. Probably not a good thing. We can't see shit. And we know there's a wolf. Hopefully he can't see shit. Although we smell. Oh, that's a bridge. That's why I run into the four wolves on their back end bridge. Good timing for the fog to roll in, wasn't it? Really doing my stamina back right about now. Do miss it. Even though in the uh, survival mode we don't actually have much stamina and we had even less in the uh, four days of the night we are actually playing with a lot more than we used to no rabbit let's go get us some more story Lily was your daughter. You have a good heart, Mackenzie. You see things others would miss. But the name, Lily Barker, related to the farmer? You said they were liars and cheats. The years have made me angry. Lily was my daughter. Our daughter. I am also a Barker. The farmer was my husband. You lived apart? Yes. Our Lily died climbing. She wanted to summit all the peaks on Great Bear. She was young, already very talented. One day she went out alone. I said no, but he said yes. Let her go. She needs to face it alone. So she faced it alone. And fell. I never forgave him. And the pearls? They were my mother's. I gave them to Lily on her 16th birthday. 
the year she died. I wanted the pearls buried with her, but her father wanted to keep them to remember her. We fought bitterly and never spoke again. Losing a child is... Like losing your own life. I think losing your own life would be preferable. But now, maybe you can save your friend. And Lily's death doesn't have to be for nothing. How? Take this key. Upstairs, in my Lily's old room, is a trunk with her old climbing things. Big ass key. Take the rope and the map. Follow Lily's path and you'll find the back way through the mountains. Or fall and die. It's the only way to find the route to Perseverance Mills. I hope you find her. Oh yes, the only way now. Thank you. What will you do? I'm content to sit here and think of my Lily resting with her favorite pearls. Can I have the gun then? You've done a lot for me, Mackenzie. I won't forget about you. I... I'll try to come back. No, you won't. Well, or I'll send help for you. You will, because all I should say. There's bound to be someone out there who can help. My journey is finished. But yours is only beginning. Go. Go and don't think of Grey Mother or Milton. We're of the old world now. The new world is for the strong to survive. Foreshadowing. Trust me more. Guess what I've got for you. I got you some more food. Is that all you give? Fuck it, you ain't having that. Let's go make some bandages. Um, Cream Mother. Retrieve your climbing gear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What am I doing? Idiots. It's in here. Oh, we've got plenty of cloth on us. Oh. So that's what I was doing. We need 50. Bandage gives us 5, so we need 10 bandages. Which we've got more than enough cloth for. Ooh, we'll be able to make some pants. Back to crafting. Oh, button. Right, that's probably enough. I would like to not be here. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Enjoy. Better boots. So you won't get far in this rugged terrain if you don't have the right footwear. I only have what I had on me when I crashed. <coughs> not all the shit we've been looting off dead bodies as we went. You may have to take what you find left behind. My feet are fine. Don't be so stubborn, Mainlander. Here, take these old boots. They belong to my... Oh, never mind. Just take them. They are some of the best you can get for climbing. They'll help keep you going. <laughs> Try that again. So, you should be done. Bosh. And I've got some new boots to put on. There they are. Decent mountaineering boots. Fan buckantastic. Where? Cool. Uh, let's chill out here for the day. Do some repairing. You know, the stuff.
That's annoying, you can't make the pants because they don't exist. Oh, yeah, I still can't loot this second house. What about the toilet water? I don't trust it. Uh, Lily's room. Lily's chest. Let me guess, a rope. Oh, yes. Ooh. Maybe. Aha! Through the mountains. Never thought of that. Now. Let's repair it. Rather annoyingly. It's a lot better than our bloody ski jacket. Is a lot better than that one as well. Oh, looks like we're leaving our coat behind. We'll leave it here. It's dark. There are monsters. Chapter 4 Paradise Lost. Wasn't even paying attention. Didn't realize there was chapters. Hi. Hopefully he's going to give me some more stuff now that I've got a thing. It's more soup would have been nice. Let's sleep so we can get some light. And then we'll uh, head off, loot our way to the drop-off. And come back and sort our shit out. Let's probably have a drink. Climbing socks. Oh, they're much better. I got about those. Pretty sure I scrapped some or left some of them behind as well. Very stupid of me. Put them on. Can't even bloody see what's here anyway. Got a vague outline. Right. There's nothing pressing we need to drop. Are you full? Eh, close. I bet you don't use the point seven either, do you, you bastard? You did. Okay, this will do. Time. You're not a bad time to head out. I don't need you. Skip some of this. It's not much, but it is messing up my inventory. You're a lot, so let's get rid of you. Drops again. Let's see if we can get another hour skipping. Nice. Right, let's go and get down the mountain. Now, there are two more drop box keys to find. I'm trying to remember what we've actually looted. Feels like we've done everything at this stage. Bloody sign. So maybe the cars. Could end up being nice. useful. Not nice. quickly hustle through all of these. Maybe we can find a key or a note. I don't know how 
important they are to the completion. Ooh. Did not realize that was a thing. I learned something new today. Put myself in. Ah, okay. It's a way to escape the wolf. Interesting. Go this way. I think we've done all of these. No real way to tell, is there? If we left the visors open, that would help. But we haven't. Okay. We must have done you. Possibly not. I mean, there's fuck all in any of them, but we've missed quite a few. Or intentionally haven't been through a few. Sounds like an angry, angry wolf. This will come handy. I heard footsteps. I think we've done this house. I know we've done that, that house. There is a house on the hill. Did we do both of these houses? I know we did one. Where did Daniel are you the one who stripped all the curtains from? Did not check my rabbit trap. Included in this as well. No, because I want to left the woods. Okay. So, how's we missed? Maybe there's a key in here. As a note, handwritten letter of blotching ink suggests whoever wrote it did so while crying. I don't want to do this, but I don't have a choice. I just can't stay in Milton anymore. It's just too empty and sad. I know I promised to stick with you through thick and thin, but I never signed up for this. I'm sorry. I send food when I get to the mainland. I hear they have more than... I hear they have more there. Love, N. Oh. Hope I can still eat this. Keep saying that as if that's going to stop me. I've got a good feeling about this place is going to have a key for me. Oh, do I need new pants? I do. What have we here? Nice. Worth repairing? Yeah, a little bit. We don't have any cloth. Yeah, would you look at that? Add some cloth. Close enough. What's our temperature like? 18. Nice. Suppose you've got a key in there. Hmm. 
Sneaky. Toaster, don't trust you. Piss off. Yeah. You've got a key, I know you do, you've got a key, come on. That'll come in handy. Would be nice to at least get all of the Dropbox keys. T-shirt. Behave. Damn it. Right. We are running out of places to check. I do you? I assume no. Well, fighters were down, so we have done you. Onwards! Ah. Got an empty trunk. Down visors. I mean, there is another house over here. There's normally a wolf here. But hopefully this is actually a visitable house this time. This are in a little bit of trouble. Oh, good. Well, um, let's check this out then. Have you got a key for me? You're not a real house. That doesn't bode well. Scarf and a note, and a soda and some soup. This will keep the lamp burning. Hmm. Well, it's a really done note, I suppose. No. Cave hidden cache. Fucking great. There are some supplies hidden under a pile of rocks in the cave near Radio Tower. I don't trust anyone anymore. People are getting desperate. And it's only been a few days since the power went out. I'm going to stash some supplies in our special place above town. You know, near where we look at the stars together. You may need them before help gets here. Well, okay. well. What do we have here? Yes, well, well, indeed. Oh, you dirty bitch. It's all the way up there. It's going to take me fucking ages. If you enjoyed this episode, then leave a like, perhaps subscribe, and check out the rest of the channel. And why not join us on the Facebook, Twitter, Discord, and Patreon? Links are in the description and rolling through the credits right now. I've been Landis. This has been The Long Dark. Thank you very much, and see you soon.